Listen guys, I'm in the middle of working out right now. Okay, I'm working out outside again. And that's because something hit me like a ton of freaking bricks. And uh, I'm just, I'm so OCD when I get certain things in my head that it's like, you know what? This outdoor workout, max effort, trap bar, clean and press can wait because I need to convey a message with you fellas. Uh, could be bro science, could be uh, analytically correct clinical science. I don't know. I can't read the literature, okay? I can't read the literature. So I've come to this conclusion and everything hit me like a ton of bricks, not at once, brick here, brick there, piece by piece. I've kind of come up with this theory, guys. Christ, could there be any more fighter jets and cars flying by right now? Uh, and the theory is, guys, listen, how many pale people are out of shape? A lot, right? People that tend to be weak, soft, pale, are usually out of shape, right? Do you ever see people that, you know, are tan? Do they have that same amount of weakness and softness within them? It's an interesting theory, right? And then here's another piece. Piece by piece, we're gonna build this puzzle. Construction workers, manual labor dudes outdoors tend to be manly men, right? So which one came first, the chicken or the egg? Is it that the manly men go into construction or is it that these men are lifting weights in this ultraviolet radiation? You understand what I'm saying with this? Okay. Then it led me to something else that I read and I tried reading the analytical research and it's just too god dang complex. So uh, you can just Google uh, UV radiation androgen receptors. You'll see articles. Anyways, I believe, and I don't believe, it's not like I, you know, I just piece by piece, I'm figuring out this puzzle. I could be one of our highest IQ'd individuals in the fitness industry in today's day and age. It could be. And uh, I've seen a couple things. First and foremost, I had to go to Ergolog because it's uh, it's for bro scientists like myself. So they break it down, really. They break it down well. And the only thing I could find is that UV radiation uh, enhances the effect of uh, nitrates in your body, basically. So, you know, you'll get a sicker pump, vascularity, stiff, hard as hell erections, right? I mean, that's a win. Who wants that? Who wants that? Um, so I was like, that's sweet. Okay, let's look up uh, the analytical data, the PubMed journals, and uh, I don't know. It's it's too complex for my brain. Okay, but if I'm not mistaken, it's that it improves the the uptake of the receptors of the androgens or so the sex hormones or something along those lines. Anyways, it, it's it's uh, it's all coming together, guys. I might just have to switch my workouts permanently from the dark the darkest dungeon that you've seen on YouTube. And I, I would I would go out there and rival anyone. No one's got a darker gym than I do. Uh, might switch it to the UV radiation, therefore making these free floating androgens in the bloodstream, you know, be usable as opposed to just floating around, not sticking to them receptors and them muscle cells. I don't know. I'm Listen, I'm not a chemist, biochemist, I'm not a rocket scientist, you know, I'm just a, I'm just a man that's obsessed with getting the most out of what we got, you know what I'm saying? So I'm just wanted to convey this message, uh, you know, maybe I'll post the article, we'll see if we got some higher IQ individuals, listen, I'm pretty high IQ when it comes to making stuff up, right, like I don't think anyone's, listen, what you guys saw yesterday with the trap bar deadlift, that's just scratching the surface. You know what I mean? If you really wanted like a hundred exercises for the trap bar dial, I could do that. If you wanted a hundred exercises with the um, anything, whether it's a, 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 an easy curl bar, a football bar, uh, a dumbbell, um, uh, and a Kanza lap pull down, like I could do it all. But I can't, I can't interpret the clinical data. I just can't do that. So I'm gonna need some help from you. And I want some suggestions. And I want, to, I want discussion in this comment board 
of how many pale, soft weaklings do you know versus, you know, thick, stacked, tan dudes, right? Let's see a raise of hands.